since you're here, as many of you know, I spent a good portion of my life at a uh, car dealership selling cars. It was a pretty long five months of my life. The problem was I wasn't any good at it. Or, well, I was good at it, but not at first. Anytime I'd be in the showroom, you know, walking around, just waiting, waiting for somebody to show up so that I could go out onto the lot and talk to them. Be like, hey, I'm a nice guy. I'm not a regular car salesman. You know, we were selling new Lincolns. We were at a Lincoln dealership, but we also had used cars. So, but I wanted people to understand, I'm not a regular used car salesman. I was dressed nicely, you know, shirt and tie, not, not plaid, none of it was plaid. Just uh, presentable, nice haircut, not like I have now. And uh, so I wanted, I was waiting. I was waiting for people to, to show up so that I could uh, go and show them this. So I'd be standing in the showroom, you know, waiting, just watching. There's somebody right there. <laughs> See somebody pull up, right? They'd pull up onto the lot, drive into the little circle. Then they'd go around and uh, they'd, they'd get out. They'd get out of their car and like, all right, now's my chance. Now's the time you're supposed to go out and then go through the, the, the process. I can't remember the, it was a while ago, there was a uh, like a 11 question process. I think I think maybe the, the word was greeting or something like that and it was an acronym, you were supposed to remember it. So, there they were, out there. They're waiting for me to arrive to come and be their knight in shining armor, their, their savior on the car lot. It was at that point that I would go and hide in the bathroom because I was afraid of what might happen if I actually went out there and talked to other human beings on a car lot. My fear was that I would get out there and they would, I don't know, open their trunk, stuff me inside and we'd, they'd drive me away and then take me forever. Away from my family to where I could no longer be a knight in shining armor to people who would come to the car lot. Of course that was ridiculous, that was not what was going to happen. You know, it was the middle of the day, it was during business hours. These people were there to get help in buying a car. They wanted a salesperson to come out and talk to them and help them do the thing they needed to do. Find the car. Do we have it? Do we have a car that's going to be perfect for their kid's first car? Or for their second car? Or for their replacement car? Do we have it? They were waiting for somebody to come out. But that's not what I was doing. I was not going to come out. Or at least not most of the time. You know, I did sometimes. I had a really great opportunity to do a fantastic job there. The other salesmen, they were, for the most part, they weren't doing the same thing as I was, but one of the guys was normally too drunk to understand that there was anybody out there on the lot. The other guy was busy watching YouTube videos, probably Nyan Cat at the time, you know? Whatever that Pop-Tart cat that was on the screen, I can't remember exactly how it went, but he was busy doing that. And the other guy was probably off in the, you know, the service bay making jokes about people who had bad credit. So I had an opportunity. I could have just gone and done superbly well uh, at this job. But ultimately, I was afraid. I was afraid that uh, if I went out there, I'd talk to these people and they'd be like, uh, <laughs> we don't need your help. We got this. Which really, you know, that's just a buying signal that I didn't quite understand at the time. Ultimately, I realized that car sales was not my gig. Uh, so after five months of actually moving up the leaderboard, you know, of the sales each month, I was doing all right each time. I just determined that it was not, not my thing. So I left. Well, I hope you enjoyed that story of JR and one of his many jobs over his lifetime. Hmm? Oh yeah, no, there's, there's nothing on the grill. I just used it so that I could uh, have the microphone there.